All right, folks, let's deal with this story here. Now, I already told you we already got enough ignorant, crazy white folks in America. Add the, uh, the Italians to it. Now, check this here out. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is Gucci, okay? They have some black I want y'all. I want y'all to show. Come on, y'all. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Wow. All right. So, Gucci, y'all, no. came up with the idea of creating this sweater. No, sir. $890. No, sir. No, sir. Y'all, this is a sweater. No, sir. Okay. This is a sweater from Gucci. It's not real. It's supposed an so actual those sweater. Are, those lips are made out, not, of, out of fabric. They got their ass whooped on social media. <laughs> <laughs> Apologize. They've now pulled the sweater from stores and online and said, quote, we consider diversity to be fundamental value, <laughs> right. fully upheld, respected, yeah, and at right. the forefront of every decision that we make. How much? But 800 dollars eight, No, $890. Come on, man. That's what they were charging for that sweater, which sweater. essentially is blackface. <laughs> no, it's, it's black. It's a, it's a coon. It's a coon show. But All see, you need is a hat and some white gloves, see, and you can go on stage. If it wasn't for the, the disorientation that I talk about the CTCA, we would just not do nothing with Gucci ever again. Right. So what? They apologize, but to have the oh, doesn't vision... Matter. To even put that out there, Gucci Mane need to change his name. Soldier Boy need to no take off that Gucci headband. It's very right. dehumanizing of black it's people. It's similar to December when Prada <sighs> they sold yeah. Yeah. the monkey blackface keychains. Yeah. There were monkeys. No, no, that one's worse. Anybody I saw walking down the street with that would be taking their life in their hands. But what's worse is that's exactly. what's worse than all of this is some of us gonna go buy some Prada, some of us are gonna buy some Gucci. Somebody might have that sweater. Just like black men who are not who are putting themselves at risk for HIV, we are constant questioning of our worth as well. So when white people like Prada and Gucci put out racist, crazy stuff, we still go and buy it. It's ridiculous. It's the same men, it's the same mind. It's a good thing that Gucci don't spread HIV. And, that and that here, we know and, of. And go go to my uh, computer, please, iPad. Mm -hmm. uh, this was the Prada keychain yeah, the they were selling for five hundred and fifty dollars. Man, right. come on, come on. We're not talking about Ralph Northern I'm with a plan out there on a black face. This is twenty nine. No, see, white people being being white people is going to happen. We need to be. We need to have a transformation around Agreed. tolerance sure. of white supremacy. Sure. And, and stop allowing ourselves to be played and thinking that we are doing something wrong by resisting white supremacy. Right. Cleo, go ahead. I'm sorry, CJ, go ahead. I'm waiting for the other celebrities and athletes that are wearing it, which is Rihanna. I'm looking at the list right here. Well, that's what I'm saying. Wearing Gucci. Wearing Gucci. Blake Lively. Brad Pitt. Didn't he just do... Plan B. He's making all the black Blake movies. Blake. Right. He got Bill Street out <laughs> yeah. for an Oscar. Of course. Plan so, B. Anytime you see him, that's our so great white movie father. We yeah. need to, at the Oscars, whatever is coming up, I'm hoping nobody be wearing Gucci on the runway. How about that? See, right. Well, th that's a sign of intelligence right there. Yeah. Well, we shall see what happens. All right, folks, back to our Roll Mark Unfiltered video in just one moment. Calling all HBCU alumni, students, and leaders. Enter the Ford Motor Company HBCU <laughs> Mobility <laughs> Challenge. Can y'all calm down? I'm working here. Okay. Thank you. Can y'all win? The, you can enter the HBCU Mobility Challenge and win $25,000 for your school. Now, building on their long-term support of HBCUs, Ford is looking to improve mobility in HBCU communities through innovative solutions. Uh, the winning program will receive a grant of up to $25,000 to implement the proposal. Now, the deadline to apply is March 31st, 2019. Let me say it again. The deadline to apply is March 31st, 2019. I want you to go to fgb.life. fgb.life for more information and to apply. Ford goes further in our community and we appreciate Ford Cares being one of the partners here with Roland Martin Unfiltered. Now back to your Roland Martin Unfiltered video. Hey fam, I want you to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash Roland S. Martin. And don't forget to turn on your notifications.